Hello, everybody. Welcome back. American Tank Ace by Compass Games, designed by Gregory M. Smith. We are on mission number 22 of our Broad Axe campaign, farthest I've ever gotten. Um, hell, we've been there since, I think, August or July. I don't think I've ever made it past, made it that far. Um, we are in the last week of August. Go ahead and roll five. Which is going to give us a movement to contact, uh, contact Operation Cobra. Cobra is still in effect. The second time we got Cobra now. That's a good thing. Um, Cobra is still in effect in August, so that is that is open. All right, um, movement to contact. Then we are going to look at our weather. Three. Snow. No, not snow. Rain. I was going to say, I'm not there yet. We're still in August. Rain. Rain's just as bad. And then we're going to go to terrain. We've had woods lately. This time we're going to be in open. The open's going to be long range with bad modifiers. Uh, despite the rain, I'm going to come in open. So let's go ahead and put us open country or long range. Um, you know what? I did not use my APCR last time, so we have two of them still. I'm going to do the same thing I did last time. I'm going to put AP in there. That almost cost me last time. I'm going to put two APCRs in here. It almost cost me that damn AT gun coming out, the 88. It's all right. We managed. Um, Took a lot of chances I probably shouldn't have taken. I need to start being a little more patient, putting smoke out. Uh, we're going to load up the rest with HE. I used to come in with Wooly Pete. That way, if a tank or something is threatening me, I can go ahead and smoke them out. And I can take out an AT gun, or I, I may start doing that again. I, you know what? Let's start doing that again. And we'll go ahead and just control R that one. I'm still in setup phase, so it's not going to hurt. I'm going to go ahead and put a Wooly Pete out. Um, just because that, that 88 scared me, and um, I it almost cost me. And I prefer, I think, to go ahead and um, have Wooly Pete in there so I can handle that kind of business. So if I do get a bad tank, I can go ahead and fire it at them and smoke their area. And that gives me a little time to get hold down and get the proper ammunition in there. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. We're going to come in opened up. I still have Eagle Eye. So we're, we're opened up now. Um, that's all I'm going to do. So, let's go in and get our opponents together, shall we? Seven in August. Two wheeled and one recon. Two wheeled, we got to roll for. No. Wheeled are absolutely trucks. That's right. And, um. A recon. Two wheeled, one recon. And the recon is going to be a 5, which is going to be an SDKSC 222. All right, let's see where they're coming in. Truck number one comes in straight ahead. Truck number two comes in over here on the right. And truck number three comes over here. I mean, have, uh, recon comes in on the left. All right, and infantry. It's going to be four. That's going to be Vermock. So these guys are going to have Vermock with them. Let 
right now they're covered up. All right, uh, and I think we are ready to roll then. I don't think I've forgotten anything. Um, they get to go first. No. Enemy fires first in round one. Yes, they do. This is movement to contact. And these guys are not dug in, so we're going to go work from right to left here. This truck's going to go ahead and drop off his infantry. And this truck's going to go ahead and drop off his infantry. And this guy is going to fire at somebody else. So they're done. Our turn. Um, we are straight ahead. We have Wooly Pete in. I'm going to go ahead and fire at that infantry right there because we don't have to worry about firing at him. I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, I have that in the wrong, <laughs> wrong bin. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and fire that, and that's why I did that, so it, it gives you the smoke. We're firing it at that smoke area right there. Um, I mean, so the Wooly Pete going against the infantry. Got to go to V1. Uh, we're long range. We're going to roll a 10. Minus 1 is a 9. Plus 1 is a 10. So we're just going to suppress that. Woolly Pete rounds a hit. Always destroy an AT gun or wheeled vehicle. A miss. Uh, Woolly Pete hits. Infantry causes one step. A miss suppresses them only. So we do get a miss on him, which is going to suppress him only. And, um, second shot, well, we should have loaded, we're against infantry, I'm going to go ahead and fire an HE off on him. And then, I think, because he can't do much, I'm going to go ahead and load, you know what, no, let's take care of the infantry for now. That two centimeter can take us out. We'll go ahead and load HE in, and we'll readjust our target next time. Oh, Christ, I forgot the smoke in there, too. Belay that. Belay that. We're going to go ahead and undo all that. Uh, the smoke screens me from him. So I will not load HE in there. When I fire the Wooly Pete, I see a, um, I see this SDKSC. We want to take care of him. So I would have loaded that in. And our second... Um, Hmm. Second um, action is going to be just rotate towards the uh, SDKFC. That's getting our, our act together. Now I'm gonna. We have AP in the in the breach. We have smoke protecting us from that infantry. They're long range anyway, so it doesn't matter. This truck, nothing yet. This guy is going to fire at somebody else. This guy is going to fire at us, but he is suppressed through the smoke. That's going to be a miss, and this SDKSC is going to fire at somebody else. We're going to roll for an event. Seven is no event. We get rid of smoke and artillery. Uh, these trucks disappear at the end of the um, first round, removed from the board. So we still have one smoke there. Um, it is my turn. We go first now. I don't need that. I don't use that too much. So we're going to go ahead and fire our AT at this guy. We are still open. I did not button up, correct? I did not button up. With Eagle Eye, I'm a little more ballsy. We need a 2 to 5 to hit. Let's get our ammunition expenditure taken care of, because I tend to forget that. I'm going to load another AT in just to make sure we take care of him. All right, we're going to roll a 9, which is not going to cut. It goes down to an 8. Plus 1 is a 9. We miss. Second shot. And I'm going to load another APR, APCR in there just to make sure. And we're going to go ahead and miss again, I believe. Yes, we need a 2 to 5. It's going to be an uh, 8. Goes down to a 7. Goes down to a 6. Goes up to an 8. I mean, not an 8. A 7. Yeah, I know math. That's my new math. All right. So we pissed him off royally now. Um, this guy is going to fire at. Somebody else. This guy is still firing at us. He got a 10. That's going to miss. This guy is firing at us now. 7. And he's at long range. Uh, 
Um, he goes uh, seven. His first shot, plus one is an eight. So he does nothing to us. He misses. And then we go to event. Eight, nothing. Smoke and artillery. We now no longer have that smoke screen up there. Um, it is my move first. I'm going to go ahead and fire our APCR and load another APCR in. Don't need it, but that's what we have in the ready rack right now, so we're using it. Uh, we roll a seven. I don't think that's going to cut it at long range. And we're going to fire one more time at him. Uh, and we're going to load an HE in. I don't have a choice right now. And that's a nine. We're going to miss at him again. That sucks. Um, I'm going to use my eagle eye to button up. And we're going to go ahead. And this guy is firing at somebody else. This guy's firing at me. Three, but I'm buttoned up and in the range. So he's not going to affect us. This guy is going to fire at us. He gets a five. That, that's get a little bit scarier. Uh, five. Goes down to a four, goes back to a five. He hits me. Fortunately, it's just a two centimeter, so the chances are negligible, but they are still there. And he gets a three. That's an ineffective hit. We roll for an event. Nine, a niner. And that's going to be... DE1, random GE infantry, odds evens. Going to be odds, going to be taking care of the one that we had trouble with. And I forgot my paperwork again, SDK SC222 right here. And two trucks, which both escape. And two Wehrmacht, Wehrmacht, and that one, one is destroyed, not by us. And the second one is still alive and kicking. All right, um, that is the random event. Um, we go back to smoke and artillery. We're going to go ahead to our turn. <sighs> hmm. This guy's becoming a pain in my butt. I am going to go ahead and have my loader switch out the ammo. We're going to first off load four AP into our ready rack. And then I'm going to use my second order to change the load. So our ready rack is going to look like that right now. And that's going to be my orders. This guy here firing at somebody else. This guy's firing on us. That's an eight. He's going to miss. Random event. Six, I think that's a nothing. Yes, a no event. We'll do smoke and artillery. It is our turn again. We have a full ready rack again. So we're going to go ahead and fire at the uh, uh, armored car again. We get a five. That's promising. That's promising. Uh, goes down to a four. Goes down to a three. Goes up to a four, and we are buttoned up. Goes up to a five. We hit, and we get a six, which is going to be a DE. Can take care of the SDKSC. Took us long enough to do that. Kill him outright. Oops, not at this drop. We get credit for that one. And um, I did not load. I did, yeah, I did. I put AP in my load. Uh, we still have one command left, so I'm going to go ahead and rotate. Nope, not not that way. Back over to the uh, HE side. That's our command. This guy here, I'll fire at somebody else. And uh, we roll for a an event. Seven, no event. 
at the end of the turn, they don't fight to the last man, so he's going to go ahead and remove. That's going to end the battle. We once again are successful. We made that one scary. If I really meet some some tough opposition, we're in trouble because it took us a long time to get rid of um, that armored car alone. That doesn't get us anything up here. We do get an experience point right away because we're a part of Operation Cobra, so that's going to give us another experience point. Get our paper doll over here. Get one more experience point. Uh, we got no more medals. Uh, let's go around and look to see what kind of junk we can find on the battlefield. I hope no more rations. I'd rather just leave the rations lay. Uh, we roll a 10. Oops, not trades. Pistol. Nice Luger. We'll take a Luger. All right, gives us a Luger, and we'll put the Luger down here in our chart. It says I have two of them. If you're wondering why I don't have them on my paper doll, I keep track of everything on here because that's the way my math works. Um, but um, we get rid of them as we use them. Okay. Um, Go ahead and clean everything up. Clean up the uh, battle board. We're going to go ahead and clean up ours. We did use our APCR, so I'm going to go ahead and do a trade. Um, four, HE, four HVAP rounds give me five total trade cost. What do I have here in trade credit? Um, I have trade balance of 10. Yeah, we're going to use one uh, one more of them. So it's going to take us up to four. It's going to take 20 away. It's going to knock us down to five. I will get four more APCR to carry around. I think that's a well, that's a good way to to go. I like having the extra APCR around. And we're going to go ahead. 17 minutes in, we're going to go ahead and roll one more mission up. We are in September. Before we go there, September does uh, that opens up our court. So we're going to go ahead and flip our court over. Now I'm going to watch for our court. And we roll a seven for our mission. We are now in September. Mission seven is going to be a movement to contact, getting a lot of them. Oops. Movement to contact again. I'm going to, well, let's get the weather and everything set up here first, shall we? We've been to contact weather. 10. Clear. Terrain, 2. Going to be woods again. Pretty sure of it. So I'm going to come in again at medium range. Open country. Going to be open. About six senses back on. I'm going to come back to the... I, I like having that option of having a Wooly Pete in there. So I'm going to go back to doing that. Putting two APCR in. Two AP. And four HE. Just seems to be a good mix that works. I haven't had to use the APCR, but we've been forced to use it. We haven't had to use it yet. Um, that sets us up, so let's find out what we're up against. Enemy force. 10. September. 2 recon and 2 half track. Could be worse. All right, let's get the half tracks out here first. I'll roll for the infantry when I when when they have to disgorge their, their uh, cargo. 
Um, they're under their half track. Two half tracks. And then the recon, two of them. First one's going to be a 7, which is a 223. Second one is going to be, oops, a nine, a niner, which is 234.1. All right, we'll start with the SDKFC. He's coming in five over here. He's going to try and flank me. Next one's going to be six. They're going to do likewise. First half track two, going to do likewise. And the second half track six, all of them are going to try and flank me. All right. Um, they get to go first, and their, going to, their movement is all going to be into the flanking positions. Um. My turn. That's pretty easy. I'm going to go ahead and rotate counterclockwise and Wooly Pete. They will only destroy anti tank guns, half tracks, and wheeled vehicles. And wheeled vehicles, as I said in my last game, aren't, aren't technically wheeled vehicles. It's half tracks and trucks and anti tank guns. Um, the wheeled vehicles is is um, his definition of wheeled vehicles. Is not necessarily say the Puma and the two twenty. I think it's a two twenty two had four wheels. Uh, some of the other ones had wheels on them. Um, it's not going technical. He's using his broad game um, definition. Wheeled vehicle is a truck. So Wooly Pete's only going to take out a truck, a half track, and a and a uh, anti tank gun. With that being in mind, I'm going to go ahead and fire at the one half track. And then I'm going to load an AP in. That's going to place the smoke in E. And to hit, we got a four. That should hit him too. We're in medium range. That should be a hit. We may take out the infantry and the half track both. Medium range, we've got a four minus one is a three. We're not buttoned up. It is rain. Not raining, it's clear. Yeah, that's a hit. So the Wooly Pete's going to destroy that half track. I did leave AP in there. So he is gone, and I'm pretty sure that when we take them out, that the infantry inside of there goes with them. That's the way I'm going to play it, because I'm not going to waste too much time on this. So I'm going to go ahead and say that the uh, infantry's out of there with them, too. And, of course, it would have been nice to put that in there. So we got an SDK of C2. 222. A 220, 223, and a 234. Half track. Half track. And we will find out what the infantry is now, Wehrmacht. It's average, everyday Wehrmacht. And I am playing it as we destroyed that half track. We destroyed that. They're mocked. So there you go. There you have it. If I'm wrong, somebody can light me up. Um, that is my turn. They already went, so we're rolling for an event. Six. No event, I think. 
I lost my charts again. I probably got them buried. Oh, I do. No event. All right, so we're going to go back to the beginning. Smoke and artillery. Smoke goes down to one. It is our turn first. We're going to go ahead and try and take care of some of these um, um, recon vehicles. I'm going to take care of the 234 first. Uh, I will fire an AP at him and load another AP in. First shot, the seven. Goes down to a six. Plus one smoke, seven. That's a miss. Second shot. I'm going to go start loading my APCR in now because I've got no choice. I pissed him off. Eight. <laughs> it's going to be a miss again. Seven. Six. Seven. Misses. And that's going to be my turn. Um, this time they are moving. This guy is going to fire at um, us, and that's a flanking shot. Six is going to be a miss because smoke. Yes. So he misses. This guy is going to fire at somebody else, and the half track is going to dis disgorge his, um, his troopies. All right, that is going to bring us to the event. I don't, oh, good. Why don't I like that one? That is a two. I don't think snake eyes are good in many games. A GE reinforcement, one tank and one SPG. There's a reason I didn't like that one. All right, so we go figure out the tank and the SPG. The tank will be. Seven Panzer 4H. Yeah, this is going to be interesting for me to get out of. I don't know whether we're going to be able to do this or not. And then an SVG is going to be a five. It's dug four. Damn, another tough one. Yeah, we got our work cut out for us now. Um, thanks coming in too. Stugs, Jesus, they're coming in the same side. They've got my back inside there. All right. Smoking artillery. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, I, at this point, I'd say they're not firing at us, and this guy is, so we're just going to keep firing away at him. One of my APCR is going to go at him. I'm going to load another APCR in. I'm going to fire. We got a snake eye, so that's going to be a hit on him. And a five on the penetration chart is going to be a DE. So we got rid of the 234. Now. Back to my paperwork here. 234 is ours. We also got to put in a Panzer IV. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to roll to see if we had a counterattack on that last um, attack we did, too. Rolled a Stug IV, not a Jog Panzer IV. Okay. No more slots there. Um... This guy is going to fire at somebody else. The Panzer IV is going to fire at somebody else. The Stug is going to fire at somebody else. The Half Track is going to fire at somebody else. And the Wehrmacht is going to fire at somebody else. Um, event 10. It'd be nice to start getting rid of some of these vehicles. GE Mortar Attack. Uh, I will use my six cents to, oh, good Lord, I did not want to do that. I want to use that. And then we're going to go ahead and button up to avoid this attack. 
that's done on the HEMG attack, and we minus one for borders. That's going to be no effect. My turn. Uh, smoke and artillery, nothing. We're going to go ahead and rotate tank this direction. We'll turn our back on him. And I'm going to have my driver look for a hold down. You know what? No. Delay that. We're going to go ahead and reload our ready rack. I'm going to put two. I'm going to go ahead and just use up all of the AP on this one. There's no sense putting APCR out because we can penetrate these guys, both of these tanks, with our uh, 76. So I'm not too concerned with that. Reload or redirect, that's us. This guy, he's going to fire at somebody else. This guy, the tank, firing at somebody else, the Stug, firing at somebody else, the Half Track, firing at somebody else, the Wehrmacht, firing at somebody else. We are getting lucky. We're going to go 10 again, which is another mortar attack on the event check. That's going to be an 8, goes down to a 7. That is nothing. Going to go smoke and artillery, nothing. We are going to take out the most lethal of the two of these, which actually this is the Stug 4. Let's get the Stug out of there first. We're going to fire at the Stug 4. Fire and load an AP. We're at medium range. We got a 9. Goes down to an 8. Goes, uh, it goes up to a 9. We miss. Piss him off. Fire another AP. Load another AP. We got a 7. Goes down to a 6. Goes down to a 5. Is up to a six. Medium range, we hit. Good. All right. Um, so we hit. Penetration is greater than the armor. He has an armor of six. We hit him in the hull, which is going to be a six. We have a seven, so we penetrate him. We are in the 76, which is a seven, so we penetrate him. And we roll a six, which is DE, so we do take out the stug. Doug 4 is ours. All right. Um, that is our turn. This guy here is firing at somebody else. Panzer 4, firing at somebody else. The half track, firing at somebody else. The infantry, oops, firing at somebody else. Smoke and artillery. Nope, not smoke and artillery yet. Event for 7, no event. Smoke and artillery. Now it is our turn again. I will go after the Panzer IV this time, see if we can piss him off. Firing the AP, loading another AP. We have a 7. That should be a hit, maybe be a hit. No, I don't think so. Because we did, we are we are buttoned up now. 2 to 6, yeah, we're buttoned up now. Um, we need to we go down to a 6. But we go back up to 7 because we're buttoned. So we missed on the first shot. To fire another AP at him, our second order, and that's going to be a seven. Goes down to a six, goes down to a five, goes back up to a six. We hit this time at medium range. He has, we hit the hull, which is going to be another six. So we still pen, we still are penetration greater than armor. We roll a nine and we DE him too. So thank goodness we took care of both of the reinforcement tanks in short order. And I needed the load, too. No, we did load. We loaded AP back up in there. This guy is going to fire at us. He has an 11. That's going to be a miss. This half track is going to fire at somebody else. The Wehrmacht is going to fire at somebody else. All right. We have AP loaded into our, our uh, ready rack. I mean, into our... our um, yeah, come on, Greg, get your shit together here. Our uh, breach. We're going to face the imminent, the, the biggest threat right now, which is the 223. Not much of a threat, but he is a threat. Um, and I'm going to fire at him right now, use my second command. And I am not going to load anything in there yet. And we're going to hit, <laughs> we're going to miss him. He's going to fire back at us. That's a seven. 
think that's going to actually hit us. Previous target goes with six. That hits us. He has the two centimeter, correct? No, just a machine gun. And it doesn't matter. We're buttoned up. All I can do is cause us to button, so that's not a problem. Uh, we've got the um, event eight is nothing. Smoke and artillery, nothing. I mean, it does nothing. We're getting rid of any smoke and suppression out there. Um, next up, we have our turn. Our first uh, uh, is going to be a fire, a load up more AP. And I'm going to go ahead and load that into, load one into a breach. And that's going to be our, our, uh, Turn. This guy's going to fire at us. Five, that's going to be another hit, but he's machine gun only. So that's just a B. Um, this half track. Firing at us. Again, eight. Nothing on the MG chart. And the Wehrmacht infantry firing at somebody else. Random event. Ten. That's another mortar attack, if I remember right. Yes. Minus one goes down to a five. Nothing. Our turn. Can actually fire back again. Uh, we are going to fire at the uh, 222. We're going to fire and load another AP in. We fired at him before, so that's going to help us a little bit. Seven should be a hit. Seven goes down to a six for the gunnery. Five for previous target. And we are buttoned up, which is a uh, six. So we hit again. Hit them in the hull, which is an easy penetration. A nine is going to be a DE on them. So we are kicking a little butt here again. Wreck him. Go over and take the 230, 232 out. 223 out. I don't, think, I don't know what I'm thinking. 223 out. Okay, him. And I'm going to rotate my tank for my second order then. Back over to the next threat, which is the half track. And it is their turn. The half track is firing at us. Nine, it's going to be a miss. The Wehrmacht infantry is firing at somebody else. We have a random event check. Seven, it's going to be no event. Smoke and artillery, nothing. We are going to fire at the half track. I'm going to fire an AP and then I'm going to load an HE in. A four, that's going to be a hit. I'm going to penetrate through him easy enough. That's a four. That may not be a what we want though um no nope, that's a de still that's a de still we take out the half track that's a, that's that is a lot um that may actually get us a really good medal that's two ar uh, two armored cars two half tracks two tanks that should get us some kind of a medal um, bum, 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 random event, 11, don't like that one either, or not random event, event check, or DE1 random German vehicle, well, we don't have to worry about that, because they're all gone, this guy is the last in the battlefield, he does not stick around, he disappears, that leaves us in control of the board, we don't check for a counterattack. And we're going to go and do our paperwork here real quick. So that was another successful mission. And I'm going to scroll on across here to see. Yes. Oh, wow. Medal of Honor. Is that right? Let me double check my rule book and make sure that we actually do earn that. I've had my stuff wrong before. 
Uh, awarded to a tank commander who destroys five vehicles and or anti-tank guns in a single battle while having received a wound. Uh, no, we don't get it during the battle. Okay, so i got to change that too. I will upgrade this once I've done all the changes. I know I have it up on BGG, but um, if and... Yeah, I'm going to put an end in there. And, um... This equals, I think it's WND. No, it does not equal, duh. Come on, Greg, get it together. It does not equal blank space. There we go. That'll work. And that should take care of that Medal of Honor, which we, we do not want to get unless we actually earn it. We got the vehicles for it. We just never got wounded. There we go. It takes care of that. I don't want to get anything we don't earn. We do get the uh, VUA. VOA. Let's make sure we get that too. That's a unit award. Uh, let's see if I can find that one. Unit awards. I know it's in there. Unit awards here it is right there, duh. Um presidential unit. Valorous unit, which is considered the unit equivalent to the silver star, is awarded to a unit. Um, who successfully completes five missions in a row and also destroys at least five enemy tanks or SPGs in that time period. One, two, three, four. I'm coming up short. And I bet you I have that also. Tanks or SPGs in that time period. Yes, they do not count. So I'm, I'm aiming at the wrong one. If and. PUC. PUC is. <sighs> eight missions in a row destroys eight tanks, SPGs. Yes, I've got to. Under, I'm, I'm looking at uh, this one and it should be. This one. I think. No, that's the right one. That adds them up, but I think I'm doing the math wrong there. I'm going to pause this while I figure this out, because i got to remember how I put this together. I'll be right back. All right, we did not get the... We just came up short two tanks on the BUC. I had to fix my helper up on that, so we took care of that. I think that's everything. I don't remember if I rolled for rewards or not. Yeah, hold on. All right. Um, lose track of where I'm at here. Um, I think we did not roll for trophies. We get a six, which is a German helmet. Yeah, we left plenty of them out there. Uh, 
I'll add that in there. And add it into my helper. Get an extra helmet six. And then our tank. I don't know why I closed that. Well, I'm going to do probably do combat a little bit anyway. We didn't. We still have four APCR. So we're going to clean that up and make sure we still have the two APCR in there. They are not using lose, use it or lose it or use and lose. And we're going to clean up our battle board and we're all back to business. So that is us up till. Of course, I closed my. Don't know why. Post my uh, broad axe up. Um, that brings us up to 23 missions and uh, second week. Second, these aren't weeks, these are opportunities for combat in September. So we'll take care of some more of those later. Thanks for joining me, everybody. American Tank Ace uh, by Compass Games, designed by. Gregory M. Smith. We'll see you next time. Have a good night.